Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Food Tech Talk. In this video, we will talk about Indian food laws, which is a topic in Food Safety Officer Exam 2020. Here, we would discussing chapters, sections and schedules of Food Safety Standard Act with a detailed discussion on chapter number 1, 2 and 3 along with previous year MCQs related to these chapters. So, let's get started. So first let us understand the basics of Food Safety Standard Act. The Food Safety Standard Act took seven older acts into one umbrella. So these are the seven older food related acts. Whenever we are studying this topic, we must know the following acts. Moving to the first act, Prevention of Food Adulteration Act 1954. It is also known as PFA Act. Then second one, Fruit Product Order, that is FPO 1955. And the third one is Meat Food Product Order 1973. And the fourth one is Vegetable Oil Product Control Order 1947. And the fifth one is Edible Oil Packaging Regulation Order 1988. And the sixth one is Solvent Extracted Oil de oiled meal and edible flour condor order 1967 and the seventh one is milk can milk product order 1992 so these are the seven older food acts which came into a single act known as food safety standard act and moving on to the next slide we will understand how the food safety standard authority 2006 came into force the first initiative taken by prime minister's council on trade and industry in the year 1998 in 2004 the need of all the food laws to have a single regulatory board emphasized by joint parliamentary committee on pesticides residue and finally food safety standard act passed on 23rd august 2006 Food Safety Standard Act contains 12 chapters and 101 section and 2 schedules. This table would tell us all the chapters and sections of Food Safety Standard Act. As we discussed earlier, the Food Safety Standard Act contains 12 chapters and 101 sections. Here it is an overview of these 12 chapters and their respective sections. Here, we are going to discuss only the first three chapters of Food Safety Standard Act. Let's go to deep on these sections. Mm, here, from chapter number 1, section 3, and also from chapter number 2, section 10 to 16, we can expect one or more questions for the Food Safety Officer exam. So guys, let us end up this video by solving some MCQs related to these three chapters. Food Safety and Standard Act 2006 contain dash number of chapters. Here the options are option A 9, option B 10, option C 11 and option D 12. As we discussed earlier, Food Safety and Standard Act 2006 contain 12 chapters so here option D would be the right answer and question number two according to food safety standard act dash means food product that have been produced in accordance with specified organic production standard here the options are option A proprietary food and option B novel food option C organic food and option D both B and C here the option C would be the right answer organic food so organic food is produced in accordance with specified organic production standards so let us understand the proprietary food and novel food a 
according to food safety standard act proprietary food and noble food defined as an article of food for which standards have not been specified but it is not unsafe food safety and standard act 2006 contains dash number of sections here the options are option a 83 and option b 97 option c 101 and option d 113 here the option c would be the right answer that is 101 according to food safety standard act food safety audit and checking complaints with food safety management system required under this act and regulation can be done by here the options are FSI authority only and option B are accreditation body only and option C are certification bodies only and the option D are the any organization recognized by authority here option D would be the right answer first recommendation for one comprehensive legislation on food with regulatory authority concerning both domestic and export market made by prime minister's council on trade and industry in the year here the options are 1992 and option b are 1995 and option c 1998 and finally the option d 2004 as we discussed earlier option c would be the right answer 1998 moving on to the next question food safety and standard act passed on here the options are 16th October 2006 and option B are 16th October August 2006 and option C are 23rd October 2006 and the option D are 23rd August 2006 this question also we were discussed earlier so here the right answer would be the option D 23rd August 2006 The members of Food Safety and Standard Authority of India should not be below the rank of option A commissioner option B designated officer option C joint secretary and option D secretary here the option C would be the right answer joint secretary and also the chair chairperson of Food Safety and Standard Authority of India should not be below the rank of secretary and the next question would be the food authority shall establish scientific panels up to the number we have the options are 5 option b 17 option c 22 and option d no limit here the option d would be the right answer there is no limit to establish scientific panels the maximum age limit for the chairperson of food authority is dash years option a 60 option b 62 option C 63 and option D 65 here the option D would be the right answer 65 and also the maximum age limit for the members of food authority is 63 moving on to the next question the food authority co- shall consist of third person and the following number of members here the options are 18 and option B are 20 and option C are 22 and option D 25 Here the option C would be the right answer 22. So make sure you hit that like button and subscribe my channel along with enable that bell icon. Thank you for watching.